there. This is Beth Cleary and welcome to my home. Come on in. Hello, good morning everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Today is a special day because I'm going to share with you a special project that myself and Dave did during the pandemic. When the pandemic happened and the whole world turned into a lockdown, our home became our soul sanctuary. That's where we slept, woke up, and did everything else. So it was just understandable if everyone wanted to make sure that their home was comfortable, acceptable, and very appealing to all members of the family, and to make sure that there is a space for everyone that would suit their needs. We were one of those people who decided to do something about our home. So in April of last year, we started building our extension. So just to show you guys, this is how our old dining room looks like. And this is just to show you some photos when uh, they started to dig and uh, build the foundation. The project went idle because of a second lockdown, so we waited and waited and waited until finally the builders were back and the project were on track again. It took the builders a few months to finish what should have been a two-month project, but then we were happy with the final result in the end. We even decided to paint the walls ourselves and just to show you, here is Mr. Cleary painting this curtain board in style. So guys, are you ready to see it? Here we go! We painted the wall dark egg blue to carry on the theme from the rest of the house. Also, we decided to continue with the wood flooring. I don't know but there is something in the wood that gives the feeling of warmth and at the same time, it is so easy to clean. I love our dining table. It is very simple but durable. Our dining chairs are the best as they are very comfortable. We spend a lot of time in our dining room as a family. After a long day from work, we sit down for our dinner and catch up by sharing our experiences during the day. This window shelving that we added features some of my favorite china and potteries. I also included here some memorabilia like our photo from our wedding and from Jess's graduation day. And also some souvenirs we accumulated from our travels. We still have to get a customized cushion for the window seat to add extra comfort when someone decides to sit by the window. At the moment, my flower vase and scented candle serves as a decoration. So here again is another look of our dining room. I am very proud of what we have accomplished. Since we started using it, it gave us so much happiness. We actually celebrated some memorable occasions here since. For example, this table setting which I made to celebrate the day Gail received her diploma from college. Since she didn't have a formal graduation because of the lockdown, I just made the day special by preparing a lovely meal for her. Also, our Christmas last year was pretty special too. Just seeing all these photos again of our Christmas table just gives me so much joy. Our 
I hope that you enjoyed that video of our little project here at home. It is never too late to start your own project and make it into a reality. As I said earlier on, our home is our sanctuary and it's always the tranquility we return to when the world turns into confusion. I would like to thank everyone for joining me again on this video in my channel. And please do like and subscribe and I will see you again soon. Bye!